Okay, so here we have some uh, massively bedded sandstones which are interbedded with much thinner but quite fine uh, shales. The sandstones show some really quite nice massive jointing. The jointing tends to be perpendicular to the bedding here, whereas in the shales you can see that there's cleavage that runs really very tightly parallel to the bedding. As we come up into the fold, to come into the core of the fold, as you follow the cleavage through, it starts to turn and ends up really quite closely parallel to the hinge of the fold as you get into the hinge area of the fold. So what this is saying is that the stress regime has changed as you've gone through from the edges where you've got, you've got these um, more competent beds which are folding in quite a chevron manner so ending up looking like that and you've got a differential slip between the beds which causes the cleavage in the shales in between to end up parallel to the bed as they've slipped as the, the competent beds have slipped on each other. In the core you see the stress field that's actually caused the uh, folding.